Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install OpenWRT on a Raspberry Pi 4 the easy way. This is perfect for those who want a lightweight, powerful router setup with full control. I'm using a Raspberry Pi 4 in this video with 4GB of RAM, but if you have a Pi 5 or a different model, the steps may vary slightly. So let's get started. Before we get to work, I want to share my experience on why I like to use OpenWRT on a Raspberry Pi 4. And the reason for that is because Raspberry Pi 4 can offer powerful, customizable and secure router solution. It provides a lightweight, open source framework with extensive networking feature allowing me to add router advanced configuration and optimizations which are most of the time not typically found in a stock router frameworks. At the same time, Raspberry Pi hardware offers more processing power and RAM than many consumer routers making it suitable for demanding tasks like installing packages, monitoring traffic, or even creating VPNs and much more. Okay, so what do you need? You need a Raspberry Pi 4, I'm using the 4GB version, you need a microSD card, the Raspberry Pi imager, the Ethernet cable, power supply and internet connection, and the OpenWRT image. Okay, so first head over to the official OpenWRT website, click on their download section, then choose the image you want. In this case, I choose this specific OpenWRT image, the 24.10.2 factory image for BCM2711 because it's designed for Raspberry Pi 4 hardware. Based on my experience, this version is stable, fast and supports critical features out of the box. But make sure you don't confuse it with the upgrade image, we need the factory one for a clean installation. Now open the Raspberry Pi imager, click on choose OS then scroll down to use custom and select the image file you downloaded. Choose your SD card from the list, click right and wait a few minutes. Once it's done, safely eject the SD card, insert the SD card into your Raspberry Pi and power it on. Make sure your Pi is connected to your PC via Ethernet cable. And now all you have to do is to open a browser and go to 192.168.1.1. It will take you to the OpenWRT web interface and from there you can see the login screen there is no password by default so just hit login. From here you can start customizing your network, set a root password, configure your ports, install packages and more. And that's it, you now have a fully working OpenWRT setup on your Raspberry Pi 4. If you're using your Raspberry Pi 5 or another model the process may differ slightly Check out my future videos or OpenWRT documentation for those. Based on my personal experience, this setup has been reliable and safe when used correctly. Just make sure you're comfortable with the changes you make, especially if this is your main router. This video is for educational purposes only, the steps shared are based on my own experience using OpenWRT on Raspberry Pi 4. If you found this video helpful, leave a like, subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.